Hello everybody, I am Suraj Shetri, I am an optometrist and today I am going to talk about binocular single vision books for optometry students and before beginning I want to say that um, I really love bi binocular single vision, this is my favorite subject so today I am going to give you many mm, best books and gold stuffs, let's begin. The first and very important and I think it's a most important book in the case of binocular single vision is foundation of binocular vision as the book says foundation a clinical perspective it's really really important because it gives a very foundation of binocular vision and I don't think if any student who didn't have found foundation of binocular vision or who is not familiar with this book you're going to get binocular single vision by root I don't think so. So it's really important. It's really gold stuff. Important. And you must have this book by your second year, third year of bioptometry. And if you're a master's student, pick this book. Without this book, don't dare to imagine you understand binocular single vision. It's really, really important and it's really crucial. It's I don't know. I can say thousand words for the praise of this book. So Please pick this book before picking any binocular single vision book. Just pick it up. And the second important book, which is also uh, normal binocular vision, it's, it's also dealt with the uh, theoretical aspect and foundation aspects, just theory, investigation, practical aspects. So this book is important because of the same reason that the previous book. It gives the foundation of. It gives the foundation of binocular single vision so this is also a good book to, to just get what binocular single vision is a foundation not the procedure and all these things treatment and but the main core binocular single vision to understand binocular single vision the third and the most popular book and very good book is binocular binocular vision and ocular motility by von Norden and it's really important Pick it up and I know many of the optometry students and many of the colleagues of optometry already have this book so I don't have to tell a lot of lot about this book this is a very good book theoretical and management aspect so get von Norden binocular vision and ocular motility and now come to the clinical management of binocular vision by Michael Simon and Brookwick. This is the best book for non strasbourg disorder and treatment. This is the by far best book. By far best book. And I will say this is the gold stuff. Don't miss it. Without this book, it's almost impossible because it's so good, so good. So don't miss it. Just have it and try to get a latest edition, a fifth edition it will be better if, if you have fifth edition so it's a gold stuff it's a best book for non establishment i repeat it's non establishment so it's really good for everything therapy even digital therapy how to do, do digital therapy and every single therapy and to understand basics and procedure and all these things oh god this is also a good stuff this is also a gold stuff in case of management of establishment the previous one is non establishment this is establishment and the basics of this book is so good every optometry should have and our senior our faculty always tell us that clinical management of establishment cms and cms by elizabeth so it's the gold stuff without it you can just think to manage establishments so it's a gold stuff and have this book and another gold stuff, oh god. Another gold stuff, another good book is Pickwell's Binoculars Vision Anomalies by Brooke J. Imbans in 5th edition. And this is a book I've read in my master's and it's so well, so well. It gives me a goosebumps when I move from one chapter to another chapter. And it's, 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 it's also a gold stuff. It's also a gold stuff. Just have it and read. It's a very quick book, very quick to go, very easy, and language is so easy. But try to get a foundation of binocular, fundamentals of binocular vision first, so that you can get this book 
in a sophisticated manner so this is really good stuff this is good book good book good book and another book Diag diagnosis and management of ocular motility disorder by hansen and davis this is a book where you <clears throat> get lot of out ocular motility disorder when it comes to syndromes when it comes to anything uh, anything what is what do you say when it comes to paralysis and when it comes to ocular motility disorder when tropia mostly dealt with tropia so this is a book you have you want to pick for topics such as drs this is great book this is just great book if you are doing masters then this is the book you have to pick as i think you must pick if you are doing masters because in masters you are going deep through it and if you are really interested in binocular single vision you can't miss it this is great book but in bachelors it may be <clears throat> difficult to have it it may be difficult but in masters you must have it you you are gone through all this book so this is the book you must pick and great book clinical orthoptics by fiona zeroy it is good book uh, you can go through it it's quick easy and not that much of burden to understand in easy language and when you when it exam comes then you sort of revise from this book this is good book this is good book not a great book but good book you can go through it especially lazy student you can pick it or clinical orthoptics because it's good not great but good you can have all the binocular procedure quickly so it's a good book good book so thank you so much to listening to me and i hope it will be beneficial to you next uh, video will be uh, ocular procedure so thank you so much